This is what is making you feel awful. When you drink alcohol, when it comes to your brain, basically alcohol binds to receptors on your brain called GABA, and this is what makes you feel relaxed, carefree, and generally good. But what goes up must come down, and when alcohol leaves your bloodstream, then the alcohol is leaving these receptors, and they go into a state of rebound, and that's what makes you feel irritated, stressed, and generally bad. This product right here is called Cheers Restore, and it was on the season finale of Shark Tank. And to use it, you just take three capsules with or as close to your last alcoholic beverage as possible to actually buffer this rebound so that you sleep better the next day. Another way that you could visualize this is by thinking thinking that when alcohol leaves your bloodstream and you go into this state of rebound, this is what is making you feel off. So this right here is basically your brain undergoing GABA rebound, and obviously it feels uncomfortable. That's why lights are too bright, sounds are too loud. You could be dead tired and not actually able to sleep. But if you administer the DHM in Cheers Restore with or as close to your last alcoholic beverage as possible, then as the alcohol is leaving your bloodstream and you're going into this rebound, it's kind of like putting ice on it and ultimately making this less severe. Now, while this hasn't gotten rid of the GABA rebound completely, what this metaphor is showing is that it's kind of like putting ice on it, and that is ultimately making you feel better the next day. So the next time somebody says the only reason you feel bad the day after drinking is dehydration then I would ask them why then is alcohol hard on your brain and why is it hard on your liver because clearly alcohol does more than just cause dehydration in fact we would say that the vast majority of the reason you feel bad the day after drinking alcohol is due to GABA rebound and acetaldehyde exposure when you drink alcohol alcohol actually converts into something called acetaldehyde and acetaldehyde is 20 times more toxic than alcohol is itself so you may want the alcohol because that's what's making you feel good but you definitely don't want the acetaldehyde because that is why alcohol is bad for you long term. Your liver then uses an enzyme called ALDH to convert this acetaldehyde into acetate, which is basically just non-toxic vinegar, and you pee it out. Now there's two things we can actually do about these problems. The first is an amino acid called L-cysteine. And in the presence of acetaldehyde, L-cysteine will actually bind to acetaldehyde and form a non-toxic compound called MTCA, effectively neutralizing acetaldehyde. Then DHM for short will actually speed up the rate of ALDH activity so that you can process more acetaldehyde into acetate faster. So what this means is that we can actually get rid of the acetaldehyde through two distinct mechanisms mechanisms of action. So in that way, Cheers is dual action in that it reduces both acetaldehyde exposure and GABA rebound, which are by far the two main reasons that you feel bad the day after drinking alcohol. So if you have a friend that says the only reason you feel bad the day after drinking is dehydration, then go ahead and tag them now because this video is going to prove them wrong.